Cheektawaga down here in sunny Cheektawaga. It's made its way up to 73 degrees today. And uh, as you guys know who've been on my channel and watched my Cheektawaga videos, we definitely have new signage up here put in just for auditing Erie County. We fucking pushed them to put these signs up. So this is the new signage here that was put in. It's even got penal codes, it's legit now. We officially cannot walk past this sign to get into this lot. This is an audit, Auditing Erie County special sign right here. They've got a few of them up in the lot, all the way around the lot now to make sure that they can legally trespass somebody. And so the last time I was here, they tried to illegally just trespass me and punked me right out of here. Do you want to leave but, or do you want to get arrested? I mean, you're the sergeant? Yeah. But. Yeah, they're waiting for us to cross the sign so they can trespass us for real this time. This whole building is police department? If the whole thing is police department, yeah, it's a big one. Oh, the court. This half, this back half here is court. A court building. The court is incorporated in there. But, uh, yeah, we got a uh, new signage all the way up, all the way around here. And they uh, posted it off here for us to know where we can and can't go. Those are the signs that we had them put up so they can legally trespass people now. We'll just take a walk around, make sure we don't step inside the lot. They got a nice penal code on it and everything. He knows that we're not gonna go in there. They were watching. Last time I was here, Rogue, they uh, tried to kick me out of this public parking lot back here by the courts because the court was closed. They were gonna tell me I can't be there. There's no sign saying it. We'll have to see if they have new signs saying that the parking lot closes after the uh, court closes. Only signs I could find back there were public parking for police and court. As you can see, they definitely put some new signage up. Police only, all of this keep out. Employees of the town of Chituaga, those escorted by employees. So they definitely tightened up the restrictions of their parking lot here. First time I was here, we were up in between all the cop cars, in the cop car windows. But them days are over in here in Chictawaga. So Erie County fam, this is definitely now a restricted access area, this parking lot. Secured lot, I don't know, maybe they want us to sign them for them. But they definitely got the new signage up. see where the restricted access area goes from corner to corner here. Definitely new signs. A little bit 
bit different. This sign is new as well. This is the area where I was standing where I had a lieutenant, or a Sergeant Want was his name, stand here and ask me if I want to get arrested for standing right here or go to jail or leave, you know. I mean, he was a real dickhead. I had two other officers here who were talking to me nicely. Is and uh, on your channel? Yeah, it's definitely on the channel. You guys can check it out. It's probably the second Cheek to Walga video. The first one, I had a good inner counter, but I was up inside the police car area, and they tried to kick me out of there. And uh, I was done with my film, and I kind of left, but as you can see now, they definitely made it legal so they can legally trespass somebody for being in there, but I don't know if they can legally trespass someone for being in this parking lot still. So. I haven't seen any signage. I mean, they, can, the they say that because the, the court is closed, that you can get trespass here, but I do see a drop box there, so after hours you can drop off, um, you know, if you wanted to drop off some fines or whatever you're dropping off, there is a drop box for after, after hours, so I can't imagine that they can trespass someone back here for after hour parking or... No, I haven't seen one sign back here. There's definitely no signs back here that says that this parking lot closes at a certain time. While putting those other signs up, yeah. they were allowed to, which I'm guessing they're You can definitely see where the police cars are now. They made it legal so they can keep people out because auditing Erie County broke their cherry on an audit here. <laughs> and uh, they must have got hit with a few phone calls that, in, in that. So if you guys want to see the original, how we got in there and how we got kicked out before, you're more than welcome to check it out on auditing Erie County and Cheek Tawaga videos. And this Cheek Tawaga is inside Erie County, so. Got some flower beds set up here. The Cheek Tawaga flag, huh? Erie County fam has been in here a few times. <laughs> Officer complaint forms and FOIL request forms are available here. Oh, nice. It's very nice. They do hand them out. Do they keep them out here in the public or do you have to request them? Uh, you can request them at the window. They do give them. Okay. Do they make you talk to a supervisor? No, not here. Good. They tried that in Amherst, but they don't do that no more in Amherst either. Here. You see their dispatch center there? So Chief Wagger does their own dispatching. They don't County. Yeah, Chief the Walker's pretty big. Let's put that cameras up. It's pretty interesting. You see everywhere. See, uh... Okay. Hello. How you doing? Hi, what do you need? No, we're just taking some photos. Okay. Yeah, cool, guys. Thank you, ma'am. I see you guys got some new signage back there in that back lot. Is this a public Film. lobby or no? I'm sorry? Is, is this no longer a public lobby or? No, it's a public lobby. They just don't want you to film in here. 
Okay. Well, if I do, do you have something I can write with real quick? Uh, here. Oh, I see it's a pen right here. I got it. Apparently they uh, put a sign up to say we can't record in here, but I don't understand how that could be constitutional. Here, just give that to the chief there. That's the Supreme Court case. The signage there, okay? Thank you. And this is... Bransburg v. Hayes. It's a Supreme Court case that says anywhere the public's allowed, the press is allowed. Thank you, ma'am. Have a great day. Thanks so much. You too. Inside the facility. It must be inside the non-public areas, maybe? Inside, yeah, that's what, it, that's what, that's what it, that sign it, must mean. There's no way they can say we can't film inside that public lobby. Yeah. Now, anywhere the general public's allowed, the press is allowed. Otherwise, there would be no need for press. If the citizens could go and gather more information than the press could, you wouldn't need the freaking press. It doesn't make any sense. I wouldn't be surprised if we get contacted for video recording in there. Probably. <laughs> yeah, it's got my email address on there. I have one guy at Gary City Hall. We got kicked out of there on Tuesday, Gary, Indiana. A guy emailed me and he was like, uh, yeah, you know, you guys were recording and blah, blah, blah. I told him, I said, yeah, that's all right. And I said, next time I show up, I said, better have some pleasant attitudes and respect my rights. <laughs> I guess I think they could just put up a sign and uh, dis disallow the rights. the rights of the Constitution that James Madison gave us so freely so that we can keep tyranny from happening. And uh, apparently they think they can push the tyranny sign, but even though they put that sign up, they certainly didn't try to stop auditing Erie County. I think they learned their lesson from the camera and the news press. They may think we're just amateurs with a camera, but at the end of the day... So it was Ben Franklin when the First Amendment was written. He was an amateur with a printing press. There was no CNN or Fox News. Those are the signs that restrict that parking lot. No, there's a sign right there. It's our new signage, plus we got them signage on the inside of that place, but I, I don't know. I mean, I don't think they can tell us. We well, can't if you, if film. You notice the signage out here has a statute number attached. Yeah. The sign on the door does not. That's our first clue. <laughs> that is so. So in all, we got one, two, three, at least 15 new signs down here in Chictawaga. This one definitely is legal. It has a penal code on it. The one in that office is kind of like that one in Orchard Park that we ID everybody. Not very constitutional, not very uh, upright. But... Connected to a solar panel, too. Yeah. It's pretty green, man. Definitely more police cars than they got in code enforcement. Is this code enforcement? Yeah, these are all code enforcement, I do believe.
And that's the Chictawaga Police Department. Keeping us out. <laughs>